John 3.16 says, For God so loved the world that he gave. God withholds nothing from us. At the center of the universe is a God who gives. We, on the other hand, tend to be sinfully selfish. So we are not very good givers. In order to get better at something, we need to practice. In order to get better at giving, so that we can be more like God, we need to practice giving. God instituted the spiritual discipline of tithing in order to help us regularly exercise our giving muscles. So by practicing the tithe, we get better at giving. So tithing helps us be more like God. Let's imagine that all God gives to us is like this pie. Now here's how we often operate. When we get our pie, we think, all right, one piece of this pie will go to the mortgage. One piece will go to our car payment. One piece for our electricity and water bill. One piece for our phone and cable TV. One piece for groceries. One piece for family activities. One piece for the vacation I want to go on. Uh-oh. I need to also give to God. So here's what we do. We scrape the crumbs off the bottom of the plate and we say, Here, God. Thanks for the pie. But that's not how to put God first. When we tithe, we take the first 10% and return it to God. This reminds us that the entire pie came from God, it's all His. Out of thanksgiving and our desire to put God first, we offer Him the first 10%. This is a practical way that in our lives, we put God first. Let's face it, it's so easy to put our faith in our money instead of God. But how much faith does it take to scrape the crumbs off the bottom of the plate and offer them back to God. None. You know what? Our fear is that if we carve out the first 10%, we won't have enough for everything else. The reason we have this fear is we don't have faith in God to provide what we need in this life. But the truth is that 90% with God's blessing will go farther than 100% without God's blessing. But it takes faith to believe this. God says of tithing, test me in this and see if I will not throw open the floodgates of heaven and pour out so much blessing that you will not have room enough for it. It takes faith to believe what reality will confirm once we try it. And once our faith is confirmed by reality, our faith will grow. When you tithe, you directly support the ministry of God's church. Now frankly, it takes financial resources to seek and save the lost. It takes financial resources to help the poor. It takes financial resources to spread the good news of the gospel. When you tithe, you're doing the work of missions. You're contributing to the building of God's kingdom through the church. So what are you waiting for? Try it. God says of tithing, test me in this. Find out if it's true. Be more like God. Put God first. Increase your faith. Support the ministry of God's church.